Hi, I'm Mr. Cast at Milton Middle School, Home Edition, and you're watching West Virginia History in two minutes or less. Today we're going to be talking about one of my favorite places to visit in the Metro Valley region, Heritage Farms. Here we go. West Virginia is broken into nine tourist regions, and the Metro Valley region is where you can find Heritage Farms. Don't let the name Metro Valley fool you, though. The farm is just a little down the road from the city of Huntington, West Virginia, but it is a rural getaway that explores the Appalachian roots of the area. Mike Perry and his wife Henriella started antiquing with their three kids and decided they wanted to share their artifacts and buildings with others to promote the heritage of Appalachia. The farm was first opened to the public in 1996 when they held the first of their annual Spring Festival. After 10 years of the Spring Festival, in 2006, they officially opened the farm to the public and it's been growing ever since. Today, Mike Perry's son, Audie, his wife, Laura, and many other family members help operate Heritage Farms, which is now a Smithsonian affiliate. Today, the farms have over 25,000 square feet of artifacts and activities for all ages. Today, there are eight museums offering everything from how transportation has changed over the years to a children's activity museum where kids learn hands-on activities of how pioneers once worked. Heritage Farm even offers an awesome playground that's fun and educational, as well as a petting zoo that's fun for all ages. Guests are able to get a glimpse of frontier life by interacting with local artisans doing everything from blacksmithing to weaving. You can even catch some historical speakers. There are also special events such as their Wayback Weekends and their live nativity around the Christmas season that's always a good time. Recently, Rebecca Frank's daughter of Audie and Laura teaches about the animals of Appalachia and their conservation as the farm continues to expand their offerings to the area. If you are looking to step back in time and learn something about your ancestors or just get away from the hustle and bustle of city life, Heritage Farm is worth the drive and they even offer lodging with a little rustic and modern amenities mixed together and it's just off of I-64.